up guys and welcome back to Let's Play Alan Wake. I've got my fine cup of tea with me so I'm ready to relax and enjoy some Alan Wake. Yes, let's just, uh, one minute, let me just drink my cup of tea a little bit. Oh, I'm ready to go now, let's go. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I haven't been able to record much these days, probably because I've been consumed with other things. I've been out all day doing some studying and... I've been so tired just to record, but I don't think any one of you care. But those of you that do uh, do actually care, well, that's the reason. Oh, okay, I'm already in the lumber here. Piss off! Right, not a good, not a good start at all. Okay, there, this one. Oh look, look at the sly little cunt. He's running away. It looks like he's having a bit of a fit, isn't he? Not so tough now, are you, you little prick? Anyway, like I said, you know, I've been busy these days. Out of way, it's almost over, though. I can complete it quite... Well, very soon, actually. I recognize the logo on the power plant sign. I've seen a version of it painted all over the area, signifying hidden caches of supplies. Now you tell us, Alan. Now you tell us. Like, episode 5 in the game, you tell us about caches of supplies. We figured it out in like episode 2, or maybe episode 3, I don't know which one, you know, either way. My god, these Sagan just haven't got anything better to do apart from graffiti on the walls. Agent Nasty Girl should be arresting them, but, yeah. Light and power, the essence of Alan Wake. Um, this kind of looks like a gate to a prison. You know, the way the van comes in and just takes all these convicts in. But no, it's a generator hall and a safe haven, apparently. Someone graffitied on there. I suppose, maybe Cynthia Weaver's in here. You're Cynthia Weaver? That's not Cynthia Weaver. I swear Cynthia Weaver was more evil than that. No, it is Weaver. My word. Then it was that woman that he always sees around, you know, like, tell him to type this kind of stuff, you know? Ugh, okay. I always wondered why this area actually slows down your movement for some reason. You see, you can run normally, but. When you're turning your flashlight, wherever you're going to go, it seems to be slowing down. Maybe because there's no enemies about, so I guess they done that by purpose to slow it down. Will it help me find Alice? Will it get me back to the cabin? Fine, let's go. I doubt it, Alan. I doubt anything's going to help you find your Alice. She's like, uh, she like my grandma, is she? Don't go outside! The big boys will beat you up! No, that's what she said to me once. She said to me, No, don't go out at night. These big goons are going to beat you up. And I'm like, Gran, come on, man. I'm 17 years old. Though I don't live with my gran, I live with my parents. Bear that in mind. There is a chance I would get beaten up, but, you know, if you're going to think like that, don't do anything at all. Why am I talking over this lady? Please continue. Oh, you finished. Oh my god, this light is so blinding. Alright. This lady foresees the future. She's a bit like flash forward. She foresees evil events. Why couldn't it have been there, the world, Mrs. Weaver? It would have been so much better, you know. Mainly because we won't be out to suffering with the raped, the taken, raping our asses all night long. Yeah, I might as well equip this fla um, flare gun. Oh my god, this tea's giving me some indigestion and gas. Burp. 
see now the torch light has actually speeded up. Nah, it doesn't matter. It's not so slow that I have to complain about it. It's nothing that, you know, much of a big deal. Actually, I shouldn't waste these, you know. Only on hordes of enemies that I should waste them. These are, you know, not even enough to actually waste my flare gun on them. Actually, I can't give it. I can't give it a toss. I just use it. Ah, reload! Oh, great! Haha! <laughs> You're not match to my flare gun, poof. Alan, I recommend you actually take Weaver and put on her on, on one of these electrical wires. She would actually thank you at the end of the day, Alan. Oh wait, is there anything poisoning here? There's a safe haven down there. Forget it. We got a safe haven right here. We need a safe haven when you have one right here. I could see the kill switch that would cut the power. Now this area was supposed to be an area where it was a bit of a puzzle, but even an idiot can brace through this area, breeze. It is that easy basically. Wait, what does this do? All oh, right, so if that's the first pathway, or is it? No. Oh, this is a puzzle we have to do. We have to figure out how to get all of them. No, that complete <coughs> completely sucks. Oh, that's even worse. Maybe this one. No. That is horrific! You know what, let's just walk across path one. The bridge one, whatever. Might be something about here. Or not. Damn it, we have to solve that puzzle. Let's read the sign. Have I read it? What? Well, floodgate controls to be operated by authorized personnel only. Right, so I, I am an authorized personnel, basically, Alan. Oh, that's good. See, I told you it wasn't that hard. I don't need a breeze, even though I took like three or four tries. Oh, I feel like such a total nerd. I got my new glasses and I'm just like got my headset on and doing Alan Waken, you know. I love being a nerd. Yeah, nerd. Nah, my Joe, come on, nerd. Just like video games. What's wrong with that? Bloody idiots, Alan. That's who designed them. Well, it seemed to work when you cut the power off, though, so you can't call them idiots, Alan. Ah! Oh, yeah, I remember that part. I was about to fall into the water there. And Alan was going to be resting with the fishes. Oh, that was... Oh, get up! Oh, God. That was so close. Right, I wonder why Cy Cynthia Re Weaver would want us to cut off the transform. Oh, transformer yards. Oh, that was great. Transformer yard power. I wonder why. If we cut off the power, then how comes, how comes it, there's still electricity around here? Unless it's a separate part, you know? Looks like we've got some dodgy cunts around here. No worries, I'm gonna kill them all. You're no match to me. Oh shit, I'm low on health. No! Oh god. 
two-way knockout there. The problem is you press your bloody flashbang and it doesn't come up quick enough. It takes like bloody six hours to do something, Alan. Alan's so slow. Alright, go back in the water, you bloody fucking fishes. And I'm gonna sort you out, you dirty cocksucker, with the chainsaw. He doesn't he doesn't die by those flashbangs. What the hell is this thing? Hmm, this is the one's a weakling, innit? He should go to the gym more regularly. Do some workout, he might actually beat me up one day. <laughs> 